Welsh Government want to make sure the children and adults in Wales are listened to and involved in decisions that affect their lives. Everyone should have the support they need and have opportunities to reach their goals. Restrictive practices are sometimes used in childcare, education, social care and health services, but they should only ever be used to stop people from hurting themselves or others. They can include many different acts, like physically restraining someone, using medication, or making someone stay in a space away from other people. These can be embarrassing or harmful to those involved. Everyone has the right to be treated with dignity and respect. That's why we have launched a framework to help reduce the use of restrictive practices across Wales. What does this mean for you or the people you care about? Services should involve you and those who matter to you in making decisions and support plans. This will help everyone understand the best ways to avoid using restrictive practices and promote your rights. You should have the support to be heard if you need it. A person called an advocate can help you with this. Service providers should give you information about who to speak to if you are worried about the use of restrictive practices. Ask service providers what they are doing to reduce the use of restricted practices. To find out more about the framework and what it means for you, go to gov.wales forward slash reducing restrictive practices framework.